My dear Bahamian family, today we prepare to, to, to celebrate something that's around the world that's known as Easter, but I prefer to refer to it as resurrection because Easter is really not in the Bible. This whole celebration is about the fact that Jesus died for our sins so that we could be redeemed. There are two important words that surround the resurrection. One is salvage and one is redeem. Salvage means to take something that is worthless and restore its value. Redemption means to buy something back. So in other words, let me give you an example. If, if, if you have an, a coupon for an iPad that somebody else paid for, they give you the coupon and you go into the store and you redeem that coupon and you get the value of an iPad. You didn't pay for it, but you received the value. And that's what essentially what Jesus did for us. He took the price of our sins so that we can have the free coupon of eternal life and our life, and we could also be salvaged. We could be restored to our original value. So today, as you celebrate the resurrection, as you contemplate this season, remember what I remember. I remember when I was a lost young man. I remember when I was in trouble, when I was a menace to society. But it was through my understanding and my receiving the gospel, my receiving the benefit of the resurrection, that my life was changed forever. My value was restored and I redeemed that coupon for a better life, an eternal life. And you can do the same. So I encourage you today as we celebrate this resurrection season to remember you are salvaged and your value is redeemed once you accept Christ as your Lord and Savior. God bless you.